Alright folks, welcome back to Let's Play Metal Gear Survive. I'm the Mysterious JG. And uh, we got awesome music playing here, but um, that's not the main thing we're concerned about right this second. We want to actually um, probably use a Pulstice. And then uh, eat some delicious food. Like uh, delicious... I could probably cook something with the gray wolf meat. Um, shouldn't have put all the milk away. Although, I don't think you use milk in the stews with anything except gerbils and hedgehogs, which is weird. But uh, gray wolf soup would be the thing to do. Because it'll go bad, but it won't matter if we hurry up and get it used. And I don't think we have to worry about the uh, hedgehogs going bad, because I believe we captured them alive. Once we cook them, then they could eventually go bad. But we'll see. If we have a spoiled four-toed hedgehog that hasn't been cooked, then we'll know that, that I misunderstood how it works. Alright. And I guess I will go ahead and repair my oxygen tank. It doesn't require much. It's pretty straightforward. And, uh, oh. Go ahead and, uh, yeah, craft a bunch of these. Got no way to replace fences in mid fight anyway in this mode. So. Castlevania music, that's contract. Lose my mind there for a minute. Got the classic shock traps. I was using some other traps off screen, but I'm back to using the classic shock trap. The classic shock trap. Balloon traps. Um, restricts the movements of creatures touched. I suppose I should have improved binoculars. I never used lore, so I guess I'll use it for that. Alright. Not thirsty, not hungry, got my ammos and whatnot. What do you want? You probably have cases for me to open you. Firing unit, that's not useless. High voltage battery would be good. Firing unit is, uh, I think I've got, my current quest is guys who are going to take three days and come up with the second highest amount of high voltage batteries they were allowed to return with. I annoyed at myself for how that fell out. I meant to set it so they would get the highest number. I had just not quite enough survival gear. And if I went back and read it, I would have, um, lose a bunch of survival gear. For reasons not worth explaining. Once you assign survival gear to your team, um, it won't let you just take it back from them before you send them on a mission. So I assigned almost but not quite enough to do this thing, and then I couldn't take it back. So it's like, crap. All right. I don't know how long we'll have to defend this place for, or how difficult it's going to be. But it's a pretty convoluted map. Bob and I definitely struggled with it. We didn't win this one when we did our multi... Well, I guess that would be spoilers for anyone who wants to watch this stream later. But we didn't win a multiplayer version of this.
got a mortar or somebody up here hiding. I. Yeah, I think it's a mortar. I don't want that. They are damn difficult to sneak up on. But we did it. That was important. Oh, this is, uh... Is this the mine where, uh... Or is this... It looked for a minute like this was the ship that you find Eli on, but it's the mine. A terrible thing to waste. Or maybe it is the ship where you find Eli. Definitely worth getting rid of that um, mortar. Not seeing anyone else around. I believe we will be given an opportunity to set the digger up and see the projected paths before I got to set up defenses. But yeah, there's a million different ways to approach this thing. Okay, so that's the main two. And they've each got an electric shock trap and a fence. I'm sure there are other ways they can get in. This is a good start. And my last big defense mission, it helped to just lay down lots of defenses early. Uh, and they were far enough away from this thing that it didn't blow them up. We will see. problem, of course, is always stuff like bombers. Wormhole digger is running. Okay. Enemies detected. Protect the digger. tactics that I got better at when um, working with um, the multiplayer mode. You are going to eventually be a problem, I'm sure. So I might as well get to you now. Oh, that's right. I don't have to collect this coupon because of the mode. As far as nobody's coming from, um, oh, you guys are not going to be stopped by my current defenses. What jerks? I 
can't let this fence get hurt. It's already taken some damage. Be very aware of bombers coming this way. See, I don't know if this is going to be as bad as that prior mission where there was... Um, a whole, whole bunch of dudes coming at them. Uh, Actually, quite useful. I haven't seen the bombers yet. It's only the first wave. It's not one big long wave like before. Oxygen. Need to do pulse this. So the next wave will have people coming. Oh, they're they're going around that same way. Look. No, how are they? Oh man, they're coming these different ways now. And it didn't give me a whole lot of time to figure this out. How close are they coming? Pretty much those two ways, okay. Well, by the end of this, I could probably have the machine guns out. Machine guns are, um, can only bring two at a time, but I found out they're not as expensive to replace as some of the things that I've been using it instead, thinking machine guns would be really difficult to replace. It seemed like a pretty natural thought process to me that machine guns would be difficult to replace. Oh, damn it. Should. All right, combat dude, heal thyself. about not giving me a bunch of um, bombers and stuff. Come on, how did I get it there? I'm going to soften up that group a bit. What are you 
guys taking damage from. Boy, they're hitting this thing pretty hard, huh? It's a really good place to have a shock trap, it seems. How did you guys get through? Sworn I had better defenses set up. Well, I can't get game over here. Yeah, I know. Okay, that didn't good and go very well. Okay, that one's still in place, though it's not certainly going to hold indefinitely. Alright, that's one path. This is still in place. That's got something blocking. I don't know how well this is going to go. Because at some point they blasted right through there. to be ready with uh, machine gun nests and stuff. Okay, they're coming from this way. Who's already down there? That didn't take long at all. Oh. Fences left. This is going to be bad, guys. So I'm sure they're coming from other places, too. Looks like this was the worst. Yeah, because they're about to break this fence, too. I'm also about to lose my frickin' uh, melee weapon. Of oxygen. I'm glad she said something. Damn. 
damn. Oh, a ninja. Yeah, I was wondering about them. Uh, the bomber's not going to be able to do it in time. At this point, there's 12 seconds. I just need to not die. Used a lot of resources, but we did it. Multiple injuries for sure. You are correct, ma'am. Well, <laughs> oh, there's still enemies warping around. Wow, that, um, well, I did it on the first try, but, um, that was pretty taxing. Less of a marathon and more of a sprint than the one defending, um, the Sahalanthropist as it warped away. Let's see how much time I got left in this video before I determine whether we're doing another bit of plot dialogue here. Um, yeah, we can do a bit of plot dialogue. Oh, I might not have a choice in the matter. I can report to you that the Lord of Dust has begun its move toward base camp. Also, you've been taken over by dust. That was another thing that was going to happen in a certain amount of time. This is earlier than expected. Let's go over the details of the operation one more time. Operation Wolf. First, place the Archaea blade trap in the projected movement area. Okay. Lead the target into the trap, which will prevent it from moving. Then destroy it with the railgun. Oh, so it's like a vacuum floor followed by mega rock or fire, like oil vase and fire arrow. Um, question: Are the Archaea blades metallic Archaea blades? Because those are the best. While the plan is by no means perfect, we are forced to act now. Even though we've never had acting lessons. I do have a bit of good news. The kid did it. And the did kid it. He completed the defense support program. The Corps had some theories about it, but it was too complex, and they gave up on implementing it. We suck compared to this little kid. With this, we'll be able to take units the Corps prepared and send them in around the trap. Should come in handy for the battle. Uh, send in... Okay, you're teleporting units. Like you're teleporting Unix? What? That is fantastic. An uh -huh. ounce of prevention is worth a pound of flesh. Thanks, Sailor Venus. That's not a proverb either. Oh, forget it. Or am I correcting my own split personality? Captain, the final battle is at hand. Onwards to victory. Sure. Base development team went down to D. Because someone got injured? Okay, let's move on to final preparations. Craft the Archaea Blade Trap. Okay. How much uh, experience have I got now, anyway? Another 2.5 million now. I've got quite a bit from doing those missions with the Archaea booster thing going. Archaea, Kuban, whatever. Iris, nanomachines. Archaea trap can now be completed. That's probably what we need to do anyway. Is there anything else we should be doing here? Oh, we can uh, rescue a guy. That's probably the most logical thing to do, actually. Um, so I stopped using my um, shock spear because it was a two percent. I was worried it was going to get destroyed. A 
I'll also need to craft ammo for uh, my machine gun. Because I used it all, pretty much. Or a lot of it. And, uh, go rounds. Otherwise, um, you could go go gadget zone and um, repair or get some fences going. Yeah, the shock traps are a problem. I used all kinds of shock traps. Uh, I should have high voltage batteries to spare the next play session, but it looks like I'm probably not actually going to beat the game in this play session because I can't use high voltage or shock traps in the next mission. I could switch them over to something else. Right, but I'd much prefer shock traps. So if there's ever a time to use grenade turrets, these are a weapon that I haven't had a chance to use yet. Uh, because they're pretty expensive to replace. You'd need sensor units, firing units, composition explosives. Firing units is the problem. I need those to upgrade guns, so I don't like to use them. But, um... Not a terrible thing to have. Let's get some more um, first aid spray. I guess I could try the last mission. Cardboard fences. Accessory head, accessory suit. Do a secondary primary weapon holder. Because I'm not doing anything with arrows. Oh, but I haven't figured out any secondary weapons anyway. Whatever. Spoiled black carrot. We'll discard. All these things ever do is spoil. I'm just eating all the ones I have. I think I'll do is warp back to base and let these wounds heal, or I'll just call it a video. Uh, when we come back, I want to do these rescue missions. I want to do whatever side things we have left to do before we try the final mission, because the final mission is kind of has some finality, even though there is post game. I would imagine I'll take a break from this game, a little bit of a break when I do the final story mission. I don't know. It might not affect the LP. I might still. I might take a break, but still have some recorded. Anyway, I'm Mysterious JG. Thanks for watching. I'll catch you guys next time. Bye-bye.